Welcome to Roughing It With Ruth, the channel where everything is a bit rough around the edges. So I actually had a response from the Forever Fresh company to my previous video where I was testing out their freeze-dried backpacking meals. And they saw that I was not completely impressed with their lasagna meals. And they've actually changed the recipe. They're now using handmade lasagna. And they sent me for free the beef and the vegetable version of that lasagna to try out. They also mentioned that the reason why they use this thick plastic packaging on their meals instead of a more lighter weight packaging is because this plastic is recyclable. They also addressed my comments previously about their rehydration instructions on the back of the packet. On the back of the packet it says that you should use cold water and then allow the meal to sit for a certain amount of time and then heat up the entire meal. And they say that they've put those instructions there in order to save you fuel. The cold water will rehydrate the meal on its own and then you don't need to make the whole meal boiling hot, you just need to warm it up. So obviously you use less gas just to warm something up rather than boiling water, which is fair enough. I suppose you would end up carrying slightly less gas or making your gas canister last a bit longer. I'm going to try out these new recipe lasagna meals and see if they're any better than the previous ones where the pasta didn't really rehydrate. In the interests of experimenting, I decided to make the vegetable lasagna that Forever Fresh sent me exactly as per the instructions, adding the exact right amount of cold water, leaving it to rehydrate for at least 10 minutes, and then warming it up on the stovetop. And with the beef lasagna, I'm doing the kind of thing that I would normally do on a backpacking trip. I'm boiling the water, adding it to the beef lasagna, and then leaving it for at least 10 minutes to rehydrate. This is the vegetable lasagna, and... I'm about to take my first bite. I hope there aren't going to be any crunchy bits like last time. Unfortunately, with the vegetable lasagna, which I cooked exactly as per instructions, there are definitely still crunchy bits in it. Maybe the beef one will be better. I'll give it a shot and see what that one's like. Okay, so that spoonful that I had completely rehydrated. Absolutely no crunchy bits. No crunchy bits at all. It's really good. The beef lasagna has no crunchy bits whatsoever. Nothing at all. It tastes like lasagna. It's delicious. So I do, I do think that Forever Fresh has changed their recipe significantly enough to make quite a difference. And I would still buy the lasagnas because they do seem to rehydrate pretty well using the method that I normally use, which is to add boiling water. So lasagna is back on the menu for me. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then you can click on my channel name to see other videos that I've made in the past, or you can subscribe to my channel to see videos that I'm going to make in the future.